Finally this evening, the shortage of lifeguards is a growing problem as beach weather arrives in Maine. However, lifeguards at one beach in Scarborough say they actually have a wait list for jobs, which could be chalked up to two very special members of their team. Here's News Center Maine's Chloe Tebow. When I was first lifeguard, 40 hours a week, I love working. For people like Greg Wilfrit, the ocean is where they love to be. My theme song is Hotel California. Yeah. <laughs> you can check out any time, but you can never leave. During his 50 plus years working at Scarborough Beach State Park, Wilfred has learned the importance of water safety. And now he has a new employee ready to help. A buoy is training to be a water rescue dog. She's training to be a lifeguard. Bowie is the second of two of these canine lifeguards serving on public beaches in the entire country. The first. Beacon. Beacon, come here. Is Beacon, also a lifeguard at Scarborough Beach State Park. Huh? You gonna make a rescue? Huh? You are? Are you? She yeah. trained last year. They want to please you and work. They really are working dogs. Dogs that Wilfred says are almost built for this kind of work. They have big paws and they don't swim the dog paddle. They swim like a modified breaststroke. The most decorated one in uh, Canada saved 92 people on a cruise ship. So my first year was Beacon's first year here. And so she was just a little puppy. Lifeguard Ethan Schultz says with the addition of each new dog. It's getting more and more fun each year. These friendly furry faces also attract lots of visitors. Who in turn learn a little something. Now that there's a dog on the stand, everyone will come up and it just starts a conversation. And so at some point it gets to the point where everyone will ask questions like, hey, what are the places we should look out for? When it's time for a rescue drill. Scarborough Control Code White. Right. Go, Bowie, go! Go, Bowie! There's quite the pep for these pups. Entering the water as second responders and pulling two lifeguards and the victim safely to shore. Every lifeguard here works with the dogs, so in some ways, that's an incentive. You know, I think the uh, lifeguards really like it. And Bowie and Beacon seem to like it too. In Scarborough, Chloe Tebow, New Center, Maine. By the way, Greg Wilfret says people from out of state come all the way to Scarborough Beach State Park to visit Bowie and Beacon. I believe if you'd like to stop by too, Wilfret says the dogs are there every day of the week. One exception, one day a month. They are not there so they can get groomed. You can imagine all the sand that gets in there. Once a month doesn't seem like enough. No, not at all. <laughs>